The canton of Basel city relies to an exceptionally high extent on renewable energy for its power and also promotes the use of local energy resources. 80% of the renewable energy used locally is gathered in hydroelectric power plants across Switzerland, while the remainder is produced using solar, wind and other technology. Basel prides itself on its use of off-heat, which basically means the transfer of thermal energy via a thermally insulated piping system that leads from the producer directly to the end users. The distribution service covers over 35% of Basel's built-up areas. Basel also draws on electricity and heat provided by a wood-driven power plant that uses waste wood collected in the forests around Basel. These are cultivated according to the principles of sustainability and the power plant happens to be the biggest of its kind in Switzerland. Another major source of renewable energy in Basel is the power plant in Pratlin outside of Basel that produces biogas from the fermentation of biomass. The plant provides about 1.8 million cubic meters of biogas per year, enough to run 1,000 cars. Of course, Basel also invests heavily on solar power. The local government's solar roof program has helped citizens and companies install over 1,000 solar thermal roofs in and around Basel. By providing a free and independent consulting service and also paying for 40% of the costs incurred by such investments. Basel also runs a solar electricity exchange connecting 90 installations in and around Basel that produce 2 million kilowatt hours of electricity. Last but not least, there's the Deep Heat Mining Project, one of the most innovative programs in the field of renewable energy in Europe. Its objective was to build a pilot heating power station in Basel that would provide electricity and heat based on the so-called hot fractured rock process. The Basel plant would have been the first in the world to use this process for the commercial production of energy. But unfortunately the system caused a seismic tremor in 2006 and had to be put on hold. A risk analysis study is currently underway and hopefully deep heat mining will be continued in the not too distant future. Falling back on nuclear power to cover growing energy consumption is not an option in Basel. Throughout the 70s and 80s there was widespread opposition against a power plant that was to be built just outside the city and the large and frequent demonstrations eventually led to the cancellation of the project. Basel City's constitution now bars the local energy supplier from buying energy produced by nuclear power plants and the canton strongly believes that renewable energy in conjunction with the efficient use of available resources will make a major contribution to securing our energy supply in the future.